Welcome back to Jack Move, Cyberpunk meets Eastwood, or something like that there. I'm, I'm not, Cyberpunk meets a JRPG, I'm, I'm not sure. Anyhow, we are in the future, that's what we know. We have just ventured into a construct and had a bit of a natter with... Uh, we've, we have ventured into a virtual world and just had a natter with a construct, construct of our old man, Abner. And he has informed us that our old man is in fact being interrogated in Monomind Towers and we're going to probably have to go rescue him very soon. In the meantime, we've just been waiting for our guy Ryder to go and upgrade his equipment and uh, stretch our legs a bit. And I believe we've, uh, we've done that now. So let's go check in with our guy and see if he is ready to give us our next mission. Let's go. He looks busy, doesn't he? Ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Go ahead, play it. You got it. The Construct received the new upload while we were gone. The most recent memory is from about half an hour ago. Bring it up on the monitor now. Okay, what's it gonna show us? Good evening, Dr. Solaris. Ready to resume our chat? May I remind you that sharing your process would aid a good cause. Your work will benefit all humanity. It will save millions, trillions of lives. Put a stop to death as we know and fear it. If anyone appreciates the magnitude of the miracle you've wrought, it is us. And you show that appreciation with home invasion and imprisonment? It is your own failure to understand the significance of your invention that brought us to the savagery. What I'm offering you, Doctor, is our assistance. We here at Modern Mind have the means to take your work and perfect it. I worked at this very corporation. I know what you are capable of, and I know you are lying. You are still lifetimes away from accomplishing what you claim. On our own, perhaps we were. But we have recently acquired the assistance of someone whose research is, in fact, much like your own. Dr. Ifrit Kadir. Have you heard of him? The mad experimental scientist from the outside? Really, Eartha? How desperate are you? Dr. Kadir is one of the few exceptional minds left in this world. With his knowledge, and yours, we can finally make a full transfer of a human mind, not just a copy. If you have someone to save, this won't help you, you know? Don't be selfish. Just because it is too late for you, it is not too late for others. Please don't tell me. You aren't doing this for Mono Mind at all. Who then? Who are you losing? With further research and sufficient effort, we can. No, it will only drive you mad. Don't go down the path I did. It's a lonely, horrid road that only leads to misery. I refuse. I won't do it. Simple as that. You disappoint me, Doctor. In time, you will see reason, with or without force. Ooh. So do you suppose CEO Kral has like a different agenda in, in mind? That lady's got some nerve. How does the route into Monomind HQ look? Dangerous. After your recent career as a vandal, there are guards blocking access to Mono, Mi to Mono City 1. Word on the street is that our good friend Nullpointer can crack the security on that service entrance near Modern Body, just west of here. I'll leave it to you to get the deets from him. Then we'll need to get through the Monomind HQ security. I reckon the warehouse entrance will be the be will be the easiest. We'll figure something out. You spent too much time with Gwyn, you know? They won't even know what's hit them. I'll hook up the construct to your deck. If you need to access it, we can jack in using the data pu uh, public data zone. You should also check out Decklord and see if they have any neat upgrades that can help. Wicked Wafers. Thanks, boss. Gain access to Mono City 1 via the service tunnel. Okay. I mean, we can definitely do that. Question is, where is that? Now, I have actually gone and upgraded my equipment. So, in that regard, I am more than ready. But, uh, yeah, the question is, where is... Hang on, let's, uh, let's do some looking around. There's a service tunnel that leads to Mono City 1 west of Ryder's place. Okay. Word on the street is that the fellow hacker null pointer can crack the security on the gate. Okay, okay, we, we, we that's good. So, is, wait, is it this thing down? 
at the bottom there. Maybe that's it. Yeah, so basically off screen, I uh, went to Deck Lord and uh, kitted myself out. And now we are more than ready. Yeah, this must be it, right? Yo, no point to come up with the goods? He sure did. Hey, presto. Sweet. Yeah, so uh, our attacks should hit a little harder now. Now, what is going on here? Dazzle. Told you he'd open up for us. Not too neat. Uh, now to tear it up. Hee <laughs> hee, mischief. Okay, here are some execs. Do you know how to save a corporate defense lawyer from drowning? No? Good! <laughs> That's a good one. That's, uh... Yeah, you get, you get to take that joke there, Jonathan. That one's for you. Can I help you? Man. Okay, so this is Mono City 1, then, is it, I'm guessing? Grossed out suit. Gosh, they let anyone into the district these days. Everyone here is dressed so tidily. Work hard in life, young lady. Maybe one day you'll reach the corporate level. And of course, I think maybe for consistency, Gigaflop and it's a deck platter packet. Use it to affect subsystems. Cool. I think for consistency, maybe all of the um, the employees here have to be Brits. Because, you know, the, the Brits are all the bad guys, aren't they? Excuse me. Meeting. Very important. Is this empathic CFO? Is your suit stuck in the dry cleaners? Oh, poor thing. Yeah, something like that. Uh, yeah, we've, we've spoken to him. Uh, what about you? One of my employees? Hmm. A bright towner? Oh, now actually, where are... We're meant to do some hacking on some of these um, terminals, aren't we? Uh, some of these ad placement things, but where... Is this it? No, this wouldn't be it. We'll find it. Contemplating woman. I sometimes wonder what would have become of me if Ma and Pa hadn't been had corporate jobs. Maybe I would live in Bright Town. Oh, what a horrible fate. Or the slums. A lot of people fall through the system, you know. Ha! The slums aren't real. That's just scary stories we tell our kids, silly girl. <laughs> okay. Okay. I hope you're not planning on causing trouble here, young lady. Uh, we might be. You never know. I mean, we are. Super health packet. I'll take it. Aren't you nervous to walk the alleyways by yourself? Ha! Huh. What do you think this is? Bright Town? Please. Fine. Suit yourself. Suit. Yeah. Everyone here is kind of, um... Wait, what, what the hell? Oh, this is VR World, okay. Well, we don't really need to be in VR World. But now I know how to get into VR World. That's good. It's good to know. Wait, why Why would we have to go into VR World? I'm, I'm sure we'll figure out. Yeah, that's probably VR World more, isn't it? I've misplaced my lucky pen. How am I meant to do work presentation without it? Oh, we've got a pen, haven't we? The business lady in the city is missing her lucky pen. Let's talk to her. Your pen wouldn't happen to have a four-leaf clover on it, would it? It does! You found it? Amazing! That's the only lucky thing that's happened all week! My company is publishing this new deck-powered video game. Kids seem to go mad for it. Please take a copy as a finder's fee. Ultimate button mashing finger bots? Chrome, mate! Here, here I come, world. Pleasure doing business with you. If only I had time to play deck games. Maybe later. Well, we don't have time, but we do actually know some kids who do. So, um, yeah, this will actually finish up two quests. Actually, does she want to say more? I sure was lucky you found my pen. Now I'm unstoppable. Watch out! Alright, well done, lady. Well done. Mono Bank? Is that Bright Town businessman still making trouble for you? Yeah, it's embarrassing. He is, like, 200 years old. Don't feel bad. You're not the only one. The guy is tripping up corporate business all over the city. It's impossible to get anything done with him around. Go, Uncle Gwyn, go. <laughs> oh, that's good. Glad to see Uncle Gwyn is having an effect here. Uh, I think this is um everything around here. Can we do anything back here? No, nothing. Breaking news. Following the closing of Bright Town's last public survey, the Monomind official in charge of corporate healthcare has enjoyed extensive time in the limelight. 
little too much, it would seem, as there is now no trace of him. An investigation is currently being carried out by the Monomind External Affairs Unit. Monomind reminds civilians that purchasing corporate health insurance is still the best way to ensure their long-term wellness. Of course. Of course. Um, what else? These guys? Leave us alone. Ugh. Be like that, then. Sometimes I don't even know what I'm meant to do at work, so I just run off numbers until my boss goes away. Got a promotion last week. <laughs> yeah, don't we know it? That, that's kind of how it works sometimes. So tired, I haven't slept properly for weeks. Bad dreams? Why don't you just get them removed? I had my hippocampus altered years ago. Never slept better. Really? Maybe I should. If I can take time off work for the recovery. You're in charge of tearing down another bright town block of housing, right? Just bash the demolition button and be done with it. New kit, no one cares. Oh. People care, come on. Honestly, these corporate suits. Right, where? Where, 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 where are we going here? Up here? This way? Monomind headquarters, here we go. Uh, gotta get to work, fill in those forms, type those minutes, make these reports. It's a dutiful individual. I can't be late for work, my boss will be glitched. Oh, maybe you'd stay away from the security. Get out of the way, citizen. Uh, gosh, Prime Crawl is so imposing, she's awesome. <laughs> Very good. Uh, can we... Oh, no, th I see, that's the top layer, isn't it? Okay, and I see, up at the top layer, I think that's there's where the thing... Uh, the other, like, screen that we can ha hack. Vox Pop Journalist. Excuse me, miss. On a scale from 1 to 10, how happy are you with your full holographic monomind home entertainment system? Uh, I don't have one of those. <laughs> you are funny. I'll just write down 10, then. <laughs> oh, my word. Oh, dear. Corporates. You gotta love them. I mean, they're just... What do you guys think? Burned out suit? After work drinks? But work never ends. I don't understand. Nonsense. I get off work in about two weeks. I get to have an entire afternoon to myself. Show off. God damn. Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Thousand credits? I will take it. Not that I really need it. I mean, I've got like a hundred grand in terms of credits. So yeah, let's uh, do a little bit of hacking. Welcome to Mono City 1. Continued work upholds a mono paradise. Mono paradise? Gosh, they're just a bunch of mono parasites. That's the last one. We just ruined some corporate marketers' day. And it feels good. Justice at last. I'll let Zat know. He'll get a kick out of this. I dug around the spire code a bunch of uh, a bunch for fun. Want a snappy upgrade, courtesy of Monomind? Stolen, rogue-altered corporate code. Hex, yeah. Hit me with the good stuff. Wicked wafers. You got the Blitz Booster Hardware Module. Cool. Okay, what does this do? Boost damage and defense. 10%. Alright, that's pretty good. Let's take a look at our hardware stuff. So at the moment, we are rocking the Wear Booster, which boosts software damage and defense. Which I think is pretty cool. We're also donning the Auto Port Scan. Allowing us to always view enemy stats. That's, maybe that's not the most awesome of things. And we've currently got the mini armor chip as well. And what, we could replace that there with a blitz booster? I would like to hit a bit harder, to be honest. You know, just my normal damage. Isn't that spectacular? Just thinking about it. I mean, may yeah, maybe. I, but I, I, I kind of like my defense as it is at the moment as well. That's the thing. Oh, decisions, decisions. Anyhow, what, what, what actually is our objective here in um, Mono City One? Like, I mean, aside from rescuing the old man. Hmm. It, do it doesn't actually say, does it? Do we just go to the HQ? Well, this is mono wear. This is a 
This is a cyber shop, isn't it? What's up, girl? Hacker stuff? You, get, you got to know it. Yeah, nothing exceptional here. I don't think, anyway. Silicon Beast executes a number of advantages of subsystems at the start of battle at the cost of reducing defense for all other types. Damn, look at this thing. So it reduces our defense for all those things, but it looks... Ups our attack, Silicon Beast. That could be cool. Executes Overclock at the start of battle. What does Overclock do? I mean, I've seen it for a while. Increase the rate the jack uh, the jack move meter builds. Link man. Offensive software targets all enemies. I think this could be good. Yeah, because this will allow us to kind of deal with them um, like a lot of mobs. I might okay, I might buy it. Increase our RAM. But this is a hardware... Yeah, this increases it temporarily. And at the moment, I think it might actually be full. Our RAM. So I'm going to get the Linkman. RAM by 13. Look at that. God damn. Yeah, okay. I think that is all we want in terms of hardware. In terms of software, I think I've got all the good stuff. There's a lot of debuff stuff here. Decreased targets, defense and attack and all that jazz. But I kind of like all the offensive stuffs. Overclock the target deck processor. Yeah, I kind of I kind of like the over the, the stuff I've got at the moment. Port scan, disk jammer. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we are good. Let's um let's carry on. Let's carry on. Oh, I think we know this guy, don't we? Zat? Hi, Noah. Traitor, you're swapping sides just like that? Are you kidding me? Come on, don't be like that. It's just a single contract. I need the credits. It's from Monomind. No matter what you do for them, it's bad. Actually, what are you doing for them? I mostly spend all day organizing virtual cyberspace folders by color. What? I know, it's pretty relaxing. Hey, Noah, listen. I haven't gone all the way corrupted, all right? This is temporary, I promise. Yeah, well, then hurry back. I've seen some of those new Transpire broadcasts. I'd say it's an absolute improvement. I'm still mad at you, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll be back soon, promise. Okay, so we clearly don't feel too well about some of our friends going to work for corporate. And that's just not cool. But, okay, how do we... How are we gonna do this? Excuse me, ma'am. Monomine employees only beyond this point. Alright, so I'm guessing we need to get there somehow. But how do we get there somehow? What about this way? Did the... Sorry, ma'am. Authorized personnel only. Please step back. Can't go into the VIP area. Move along, ma'am. Hmm. But I'm a bit. Yeah, I'm. I'm not exactly sure where we're supposed to be going now. Because we're in Mono City One. I mean, in terms of just getting into Mono Mine, how do we do that? Ooh, actually, yeah. By this loading bay. This is the dumbest plan I've ever heard. Well, too late. I already made the call. The pizza guy is on his way. Five minutes, huh? Or less. The cross mob never fails. Besides, I think the plan is blipping genius. That's because you're as crazy as your uncle. You're gonna get yourself killed, Noah. Watch and learn, non-believer. Prepare to be amazed. Noah, please, at least stay on the line. Noah? Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, of course, the pizza guy. <laughs> for the pizza from the pizza mob squad who always deliver on time. Halt! This is a restricted area. What? Isn't this the delivery entrance? Yes. 
but you need to be pretty cl clear to approach. I have no information about a pizza delivery. Can you check? I came all the way from the cross mob. I have to hand this over within the next 50 seconds, man. Help me out. 48, 47. Sorry, not my problem. Please, 43, you don't know what happens if my timer hits zero. Five minutes or less, that's the promise. It's against monomine policy. It's getting cold, 32. Fine, fine, stand back. Come on, come on, come on, 25, 24, come on. And we'll take it from here. Okay, yeah, we can we can handle these pizza guys. These um, these guys. Okay, this guy's small potatoes. And this guy hurts. Why is why has he got so much health? It seems like quite the disparity between them. Like one of them's got 150, the other's got like 10 times as much. Okay, well done. Don't you have another order to get to, chump? Yes, yes, always. Five minutes or less. Eight seconds. Take it. Just take it. All right, we got the pizza. Thank you for ordering from the cross mob. Bye. I actually don't believe it. Oh, what was that? You're breaking up. It sounded like you said, Noah, you're the smartest person I've ever known. You also wear adorable clothes and you smell nice. And you're modest too, clearly. Now hurry up and get inside. This next part is gonna get rough. Alright, sneak into the heart of Monomind and find your dad. Can we do it, guys? I think we can. Let's get this. Get some credits. Now, us sneaking in here, are we gonna be able to get out? Or is this like a one-way thing? I mean, we should be alright, right? Okay. Uh, okay. Alright, we're gonna be fighting here, so let's see, so what's the objective? Where do we, where do we have to go? Let's move this back quickly. Alright, so these are the enemies here. Yeah, these guys don't look too bad. Uh, right, so I've got a new move. Let's try... Fork. Mmm, hits nice and hard. And we get some nice XP for that, that's awesome. Alright, so that, that moves the A. What does the 13 do? Alright, but... Okay, maybe that's useful, I, d I don't know. Wait. I got you and we go up with this. Okay, so we can go around here and get this item. Health packet. Not that we really need it. And now, looking at the things we've moved, we should be able to move across. Uh, wait, so that'll move the A. Do we want to move the A? Okay, more friends. I'm not wasting time with you guys, I'm just gonna... Jack move. I've perfected the Jack moves. Hitting you guys with a wormhole this time. Boom. Look at that damage, huh? Uh, yeah, let's try this quickly. Alright, that is good. Uh, then what, we move A again. Move C, where's, where does C go? There you go, that has to be useful. But how? 
Oh, uh, maybe, yeah, maybe it kind of clears the way for us. Possibly, right? Uh, wait, there's no point moving A, because that's... There's nowhere to move across here. Yeah, there's, there's nowhere actually to go there, is there? Oh, no, actually, hang on. I think this might be it. Alright, let's see what's up here. Sweet, we're in the lobby. Okay. Now, there's gonna be guards here for sure, right? So, are we gonna be okay to just waltz around here? I'm guessing not. Obviously not. Alright, we should be able to deal with these guys. Let's, uh... Executive power dress. <laughs> Ooh, we just failed to, take, managed to, failed to take her down, did we? Well, power dress or no. You are no match for us. Let's go... Zombie. Damn. So I basically got the level, the, the highest tier or the um, software bits that have the, that re require the, the largest amount of RAM. And by the look of it, that might have been a wise choice because we are dealing some big boy damage now. Can't go down there. But um, on the downside, like, having these super high software abilities, it does consume a lot of RAM. Alright, the VIP suite. This is where they were holding our old man. He's not here! Scrap! I'll have to look around. There must be some clue as to where they took him. I think there might be a clue. Yeah, what does the note say? Aha! This note is from the R&D department, signed by Dr. that Dr. Kadir Kidin. Perhaps they took him there to squeeze that research out of him. So wait, didn't we knock the stuffing out of him, Dr. Kadir, already? That's, that's what I was wondering. Um, okay, so wait, what does the note say? There's no sign of your dad in the VIP lounge, but a note signed by Dr. Kadir mentions the R&D department. Best to investigate and see if they took him there. Okay, but where is it? On the basement floor, perhaps? Or on the floor below? Has to be, right? Or maybe somewhere high up? Yeah, this looks good. But are we likely to see a vending machine though? That, that's that's what I want to know. Are we gonna see a vending machine? Because I'd like to heal. Damn, 9999! It's like Final Fantasy level damage. Let's see if we can do it again. Oh, not quite. Ow. 
Ow. Yeah, let's just knock him the fork out. Oh, lovely. Nice little level up. Okay. Where's our old man? Uh, door to the left. Super health packet, all good. Yeah, so it has to be... Aha, next level up. Hold on, Papa. We are coming. Uh, what is this? That's for us to go into the virtual world. But why would we want to go into the virtual world? Oh, maybe... Maybe we have to? Let's see. Cyber Clash, what's going on? Uh, let's hit you guys with some stack overflow. Let's try this. Zombie. And you, let's go with some core dump. No, oh, that wasn't spectacular, was it? Yeah, I'm guessing we're going to have to go into Cyber World, no? I mean, I thought, maybe. Uh, wait, is this the right way? Okay, this looks, yeah, this looks uh, about right now. Alright, I very much suspect we're going to have to throw down when we get up ahead. So, let us... Yeah, let's take off encounters, and let's get in there. What the grid is all this? This stuff is directly out of a Screamer vid. Noah. I know, Ryder, it's cracks. I'm disturbed too, but... Not that. I just got an update from the Construct. Your dad was moved to Crawl's office on the top floor. Get out of there fast, it's a trap! There she is, offspring of the sun. You, the creep from my dad's house. What are you doing to these people? Don't worry, they volunteered. Most of them. <laughs> are they dead? No, they are uploading. There is no reason to keep the deceased plugged into an experiment relying on neural activity, is there? Silly girl, dumb and daft. When you said you wanted to talk with him, you were talking about the copy of my dad, right? The construct. He will supplement my research, fill the blanks, the tanks, the power banks, even if he is the digital imposter. A digital imposter? He is a copycat of code, a thief. I invented the technology first, me. Still, I want the construct. It is important for my research. Can I have it? Hand it over, give. I think I have it in my pocket? How stupid do you think I am? Barry, you are a waste of space. The fact that you would misplace the database in the first place... <laughs> oh, please. The fact that you would misplace the database in the first place makes you a case of almost impressive disgrace. I'm going to take you with me now. And how are you planning on doing that? I've already beaten you and your goons once before, you lab coat dope. This is true. Time to see this through one more time. We'll beat him times two. 
Ah, the beautiful breath breakthrough to upload in, uh, someone's entire life and consciousness to a data drive. The answer to life and death. The technology is mine. I invented it first. But your digital daddy's playing fiddler's keep finders keepers. No, I say, it was I. He is fake. Both of him. Liar. Liar. Code on fire. Imposter. Imposter. You wish. Solaris's don't lie or steal. You're just better. We're just better. Otherwise, why do we still need... Why do you still need my dad's work? You're just bummed out he beat you. That's enough of your rough stuff. I know you aren't so tough. Come along, offspring of AI. Ooh, okay. He can play like that, does he? Let's see how... 10,000. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, you guys are not sure. Let's uh, let's try some core dump. Take, take out the, the mobs one at a time. Ouch. Alright, we're gonna jack move. So, I think he... Would he count as wetware? I think he'd be wetware, so let's hit him with some kilowatts. Mmm! Lovely. And, uh, yeah, let's keep it going. So, hit him with some... Uh, yeah, hit him with fork. Nice. I don't think it's fair that he gets, like, two goes. But it matters not. Let's try... Let's, let's try core dump on him. Yeah, yeah, not, not as great. I think I'm gonna have to stick with fork unless I have something else. Let's try zombie. Okay, I think that was pretty good. Uh, but no, let's stick with fork. Good stuff. Oh, okay, we, we dropped some kind of defense. Now I'm thinking, do we keep on... Yeah, I'm going to keep on the attack. I gotta say, it was a smart decision. Um, yeah, I'm getting all these upgrades. Let's go. Okay, his defenses are breaking. Uh, that doesn't look encouraging. Um, that does not look encouraging at all. Uh, let's... Oh, he's gonna have double... You know what, I, sh I should probably heal. Yeah, I'm gonna heal. Yeah, that, maybe that was wise. But he can't stop us. Oh! He can avoid, but he can't stop. Come on, let's keep it going. We're doing well. There we are. We've got him on the ropes, for sure. Okay, here comes some kind of mega attack of his. Nice, nice miss. All right, if this hits now, we should we should have him. Let's go. There we are. Doctor Kadir beat him a second time. All right, gained a level, and all of our other things are getting levels as well. How awesome is that? Okay, so, we knew this was a trap. Um, can we get... Can we get this guy out of here? I guess we can't. Um, and, uh, yeah, I suppose we just 
heading on up then, right? To the next level. Let's go. Well, I tell you what, guys, we're going to take a quick break here. When we get back, we will be heading up to the executive suite to rescue our old man. And uh, put an end to this thing once and for all, we hope. But yeah, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.